Did get hella dark out of nowhere. There's a zombie right out. <laughs> Basic? Uh, uh, Pendleton? North Carolina? Isn't that the only. Well, no, I think there's a different base for North Carolina. Oh, I forgot about San Diego. Yeah, no. Uh, Paris Island. Uh, O351. Infantry. And once I transferred over to the uh, army, it was 92 Yankee. Uh, supply. It was hella easier, I'll tell you that. I just had to do basic. <laughs> I had to do the basic again, but technically, for, uh, for army, but I sat there. Yeah, uh, yeah, I, I just sat there. Like I said, uh, they didn't. I had to do it because they didn't have a, a AIT at the time, so I had to wait for their basic. And they're like, you, you just want to like sit through and watch them. I was like, yeah, fuck it, might as well do something. So, uh, technically, the basic, I just sat through it and watched everybody. I did participate just to, you know, stay in shape, I guess. Stay doing something. I like how that motherfucker is dead standing up. For AIT? Oh. Uh, I was stationed in Jersey. I uh, wasn't there too long after that. I was in, in Missouri. And after Missouri, I was stationed uh, back uh, in my hometown. Ah, uh, fuck. Um, Leavenworth? Or Leonardville? Leavenworth, I think. No. Uh, no, it's There's it. a Fort Worth in Missouri. Yeah, there is. Oh, no. And then there's <laughs> that. That's a uh, Fort Leonard Wood, uh, Fort Lawson. Yeah, that's where I was. Cause that was that's right down the road from when I right down the road. Sorry. Infantry Battalion. It was fuck. It was a long time ago. Uh, I don't really participate too much, you know, green wise, because of my appendix, like I said. One take. Yeah, I just did the basics and the. Uh, uh, I got corporal and then I got transferred over. Well, I transferred over. Reserve, but they only had a position of it's pretty whack. No, I was uh, active duty, Marines, and I had to because I was still in uh, bed rest when I transferred, so they just sent me as a reserve because they're like, This is all we can do. I was like, Oh, can I change later? and they're like, Yeah, of course, and they didn't give me the option. Until my contract expired, at least for the first term. Yeah, uh, I went to um, uh, the Middle East. I did uh, did four tours there. I'm trying to remember the fucking base. Uh, it was uh, it, it was two tours in um. What was a fucking base name? It was Kuwait. Um, I'm trying to think of the fucking. It's only one base that was on there. 
to be honest with you. But that's just sad. The heat was not nice. Not the base was dope. It was all right. It wasn't too too bad. Uh, the heat, the desert, the there, there was a lot of trees uh, somewhere near there, but uh, that shit was humid as a fuck. Uh, it was infantry unit. It was uh, I don't know. It, my memory is not the greatest, to be honest with you. That's not what I wanted to do. How do I get rid of that? Just ignore that ping that was not supposed to go there. Oh, there it goes. It went away. So do uh, painkillers do kind of like what they do in Seven Days to Die on this game? Uh, they... Okay. It's binoculars. Hella binoculars. Oh shit, wrong gun. Sit your ass down. Hit this auto run feature. Train in midair or bus in midair, whatever the hell that is. So you can only go up to seven. Uh, this game or in general? A uh, couple years. Got some bandages. Backpack. I'm charmed. Yeah, it's a rifleman. Uh, yeah. Is it? <clears throat> no, it's not. Good, good. I don't remember what the name that is. ICP, you said? Uh, they don't sound familiar. Okay. Three oh. Do I have any 308? I do have 308, okay. I just remember the name. It was... It was Fort Leonard Wood. Oh, somebody just logged in carrying a bounty. Black sheep, because they were named after like the movie or something. I don't know. Uh, it was, it was 54 Bravo. No, no, that was, that was, uh, it was 115 Bravo. That's the, the deployment one that I had. Um,
0311 is the rifle man is fuck uh ass assault man 0351 assault man yeah uh I, I got a, a few nothing major per se like uh got a couple coins got the deployment badges that type of stuff uh deployment ribbons basic ribbons um which ones are i don't know i don't know their names to be honest with you i can tell you the colors i got them here <laughs> Anaconda rounds. I think yeah. I it, actually, if you want. The shotgun shells. Ugh, I'm stuck. Never mind. No, I don't got it. Thought I had. It. I thought I picked it up. Hear that motherfucker? Where you at? Uh, Probably my, on the other side of that wall, huh? My first deployment to uh, Kuwait was under Camp Victory. No, that was the one. Uh, it was Camp Ar 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 G Arjib. Uh, it had a weird name like that. The second one was Camp Victory. That was with uh, with Army. And that was both in Kuwait. What the hell is that noise? Sounds like a problem. A rifle laser. Uh, 2014. Boot camp for which one? Yeah. That was a Marine, uh, Army boot camp. Uh, I went right out of high school, which was 2010, for, uh, for uh, Marines. Uh, I left when I was 17 uh, to basic. I finished my diploma. A mystery well, okay. skin. Oh, that's it. Nothing fancy. Lettuce. I mean, it, to be fair, to be honest, I'm pretty fucking, well, it's coming off now, but I was pretty stoned a long ass time ago. You don't have any I have had a lot of injuries, and I, I do have my military ID. This guy's seen it, so. I just learned to scare that motherfucker. I, I mean, not to make it an excuse or anything, because that's, you know, it's pretty stupid, but I, I have had PTSD about it, so. Uh, some deployments in Kuwait, you know, the things that you, you're not allowed to interfere in. Uh, I've seen just random shit happen. Uh, girls getting. <laughs> Yeah, girl, not military, some not military related, some military related. I don't want to get into too much detail, but I have seen like girls get tortured just because they talked to a male uh, cadet or anybody that was stationed from our side. Uh, just shit like that. I I'm over it now, I, I would say. But uh, I definitely had to go through a, a couple of counseling sessions and shit like that. That doesn't really help with your food. Oh, I ain't got no ammo for this guy. Uh, uh. 
sounds rough. I get it, but like I said, mo most of my uh, service was um, army. I did. Uh, no, I got a other than this, or I got an un honorable discharge, and then uh, I went over to the to uh, army recruiter and I said, "Hey, uh, this is what happened. I got my appendix removed. Uh, what can we do?" He was like, "I could sign you right up." He was like, uh, uh, "We did that. We went back to maps, and they tried to sign me back up, and everything was good. Everything was legit, I guess." And uh, they were they gave me the the okay, and I was back in business, so to speak. And uh, the only thing was uh, the class, uh, which was uh, the, the ninety two Yankee supply. They yeah. But that, that was a secondary MOS. That I had to choose a secondary to be able to go back in. Yeah. Yeah. Because uh, I mean, I was already qualified and trained as a medic, so uh, I was able to keep that. But they told me to, if I wanted to change it, I could. And uh, the Marines, we did we did do uh, some Navy uh, trainings. And uh, I was able to elect the uh, MOS from there. Uh, I went from 0351 uh, assault, assaultman to uh, assaultman infantry, just regular infantry, basically, to uh, to medic training. And I was trained already, uh, not, um, what do you call it? Yeah. Yeah, that's what it was. It wasn't like a class based, I guess. It was just a. It, it was a special course that uh, it wasn't. It was in a two year training for that. And I know, uh, I know, uh, medic is a two year training to study it. Um, but I was able to get that later on in the army. Probably not, dude. Yeah, my, my, no, I get you. The, you know, the, the whole false, um, what you call it. I've, I've had a fair share of run-ins with people, you know, uh, false impersonations and all that crap. But yeah, like I said, uh, this dude's seen my military ID and everything, so I, I'm just super out of it right now. <laughs> but uh, yeah, my sister's a Marine right now. Uh, I don't know where the fuck she's stationed. But uh, I think she's supply as well. I don't know what her MOS is. I don't remember it either. Uh, I know Marine, or Army, sorry, was uh, 92 Yankee, because that's, that's what I got transferred over to after a while. Yeah, the the ninety two Yankee was my secondary uh, prime. Sixty eight whiskey, no. No, that my primary first one was uh, uh O three fifty one assault men. Uh, that yeah, that was Marine Corps. Then I got the the training, the the medic training. I didn't really like it too much, to be honest, and uh, but I did qualify for it and everything. But I ended up seeing or reclassing to uh, uh, supply, which was ninety two yank when they ended me. Uh, the army I did six, and marines I did two, so I did eight years total. It was from 20, 2010, late 2010s to fucking 2018, 20, around there. May, May 2019, or 2018, sorry. Uh, E5. Okay.
Uh, yes and no. Uh, I was technically E6 at highest, but I did get into a fight and I got demoted. Yeah. <laughs> Pistol flashlight. Let me put that bitch on. It was just dumb shit. Um, people stealing from my crap, shit like that. Oh, I can't. Got in, got in their face about it and threw hands, I guess. And they found out and they put us both in, you know, uh, uh, pretty heavy restrictions for. A, I want to say I was on it for six months. I don't. I don't know how long he was on restricted. I mean, it wasn't like a big fight, so it was just like, all right, this is what we're going to do to not kick your dumb ass out the military, basically. <laughs> yeah, it, it didn't make it to, uh, to Article 15, luckily, so it wasn't ever on paper. Uh, it was like a probation, because the guy that... Um, <laughs> got us fighting the our upper or uh senior sergeant at the time was military police or had secondary military police something he's like this is what i'm gonna do with for you just because i like you but you're pretty fucking stupid take it or leave it and i was like all right fuck it that and uh we we were drunk on base once too so that added to it it wasn't a Yeah, yeah, no, there was it wasn't a age penalty thing. It was just a stupidity thing. Yeah, but fighting drunk, uh, that's what got us in trouble. What do you mean? Yeah, and I, I had more than one fight. Uh, it was just a, one regular fight for uh, people stealing my shit. Another one was a drunk fight, and then another one was just. Um, uh, it wasn't really uh, mine, but I was part of the the platoon or the. I, I was in the group involved. Uh, somebody was trying to mail some fucking um, grenade pins to their girlfriend or some dumb shit, and nobody fessed up. Nobody was like, "Yeah, it was me. It was me," or whatever. Uh, so we all got fucking. We all got fucked. But. Uh, so with everything there was about six months total so any probation chance that i would get it would kind of go away because i would be on you know in trouble so to speak you know they kept a close eye on us and then <laughs> then i just have to watch out for to not get fucked basically and i honestly thought i was gonna get a dishonorable i was just kind of waiting for it. i was like something's gonna happen and i'm gonna get involved and I'm gonna get fucked but uh no i just ended up you know serving my service contract and once it expired i let it expire got my discharge paperwork and that was it yeah that was when uh that one It was it was Kuwait as well. Uh, I did some in state. I did some. Um, we did a lot of medical relief stuff uh, or food relief uh, to Mexico and Salvador. I think we did Guatemala once. And uh, so nothing major there, but uh, most most of it was Marines. Why the fuck does my character keep dying?
I uh, was a while ago. I was a pothead before I went in. I'm a pothead now. It's really not, but that was, that was all marine. I mean, all all my last six years were were army. I, I remember hella most of that, but even there, there's still shit I don't. Remember. Uh. It was mid to late around there, yeah. It was 2010, though, for sure. That's, uh, that's the day I graduated, or the year I graduated uh, high school. Fuck, no. I... Had to be a, it was a weekend. I know that because I was saying bye to my family and everything. Saturday or Sunday. But I, I didn't leave straight for it. I went to the hotel. Stay there like a day, then uh, Shark Week and all that shit. So I want to say it was probably Friday and then basic start on Monday, something like that. Maybe Saturday, Sunday. Oh. Yeah. Yep. Uh, well, I was I stayed at Mets for a good while. I don't know what the fuck what was going on. Uh, I definitely wasn't that lucky. I I stayed there for like a day. Yeah, I think it had to do with my like uh background report because there was a lot of people with my name that were like, I guess child molesters and some dumb shit. And they just had to clear it out, make sure that it wasn't me. I don't know what the fuck was going on. And then uh, I did have issues with weight cutting that first day. So uh, just to make sure, I guess, <laughs> my fucking recruiter put a demo cream with fucking saran wrap to make sure. He's like, just don't eat nothing. And I was like, well, fuck me. All right. I do remember that part because that was funny as fuck. You know? <gasps> Yeah, I, st oh. I stayed at MEPS for, I want to say, at least uh, nine hours. And then, uh, yeah, no, I, I mean, I barely met the weight requirement. And, um, but like that, like I said, uh, my recruiter was just to make sure, like just saran wrap and uh, hemorrhoid cream and that should burn some fat and don't eat, don't eat nothing, don't touch nothing. I was like, all right, fuck it. But uh, everything worked out, and then um, then once I got to uh, Port uh, Camp Pendleton, it was I don't know. Yeah, but uh, I stayed there, same base. Yeah, I just got transferred to another building basically, and that was it. Well, the other thing that I found weird uh, was that there was females on base as well. Like, they were just separated by a building, I guess. It was like one new sh Right. 
Yeah, and everybody told me there would be no females and shit. That's how I, I found it weird or whatever. But yeah, I mean, uh, I don't know. I don't remember much. My memory's just fucked up that way. And, um, yeah, what I, what I remember was like the. Just the things that stood out the most, I guess, that I remembered. Much... Oh, yeah. Yeah, I got those. I got my graduation picks, my class picks, my uh, got some deployment picks as well. Uh, I still got my old dog tags, my name plates, or name tags. Um, Like I said, I still got my military ID because I never turned it in after it expired. No, when uh when I renewed my ID, I kept the old one. They just gave me the new one, and they didn't ask me for the old one, so I just kept that one. But yeah, I I have that too. I got my DD two fourteen, my um. All my uh, medical records, got all that stuff uh, stuffed away somewhere, probably in my closet. I didn't really pay much attention to the base other than the chow hall and the the main you know morning run that we would do but everything was just distracted by you know, cadences and shit but uh as far as location specific location i, I can't tell you yeah uh, i don't know basic one but i don't understand the question Um, I, don't know, I I just remembered it was all old and rusty and basics buttstock that there was no extra attachments or anything on it. Um, I, uh, my ho my whole platoon did. We we all it wasn't rusty rusty, but it wasn't like the other people's rifles. It was, it was a little darker. It was a little. A browner, I would say, uh, but that was just like it worked, so they didn't tell tell us anything. Um, I would say we got the A one. If I had to put a, a my finger on it, I, I would have to say it was A one. It was just that's what I would say. Yeah. I mean, like I said, it was it was pretty basic. There was nothing to it. It, it didn't look fancy or anything. It didn't have like, any extra attachments. It, it had the that um, the handle over it so for the iron sight. Yeah, for the iron sight. Yeah. No, I, I, I honestly was.
<laughs> haven't fucking recited those in a fucking while. Um, fuck. <laughs> First general order of command is. <sighs> fuck. Ma- maintain a weapon? Fuck, I don't fucking remember, man. Oh, yeah, that would not fucking remember that whatsoever. Yeah, I know. I, <laughs> I, I was there, but it, my memory is just, it's, it's pretty fucked, man. Like, I could honestly not even tell you what the fuck I did yesterday. But, uh. My PTSD was bad, but not like I wouldn't say it was like horrible, horrible. But my memory is pretty fucked. That I can't lie about. It. My memory's just fucking gone. I don't. Know. I don't, I don't know what to tell you, man. If if you don't want to believe me, it's it's cool. I mean, it's it's all on you. It's your perspective. I'm not gonna tell you what to believe in or not to. But I, I do have my proof. And I did serve my, my time. Uh, I could say about that. Uh, I might not give you the proper answers you're asking for that I should know. I should say. But. Yeah, I I did do my time and my expired one, yeah. But it's uh, the one I got is from the army because the marine one I did have to turn in. The DOD number. Uh, why do you want to know that for? I don't know. That sounds like something a little too. <laughs> I, I don't. I don't need it, but I, I didn't know that, but. Through what, like no connect or something? That's crazy. I didn't know that was accessible. <laughs> but uh, uh, I mean, I I got I got my ID in front of me literally, but I don't I don't know if I feel comfortable with that. I don't know. I never looked that far into DOD numbers and shit like that, so I didn't I didn't even know you could fucking find it. And uh, yeah. Next.
I know. I know that. Yeah. I just didn't know it had like my info as far as, you know, name and rank and service and all that. Right. Yeah. I don't know. I, I think I'm going to hold on to that, but I can't tell you the one I have right now expired May 2017. Late entry, what do you mean? I don't think I was in any delayed entry. Oh, uh, that wasn't too long, it was uh, two, less than two weeks just because uh, they were waiting for the MOS deployment or some shit like that. They were waiting for like a, the MOS deployment or some shit, but yeah, I was, I was there for. Yeah, probably like two weeks. So I wasn't even that long. I just did a couple of runs with them, a couple of pull-ups. And after a while, they're like, hey, uh, we're ready to go to maps. And I was like, all right, cool. No, uh, I was over my weight when I tried to sign up and the maps for the first time. That's when I was overweight. For a basic? Uh, 30. Uh, for my age category, it was 30. Yeah. It was 30. Well, that's what they made me do. Yeah. I'm, I'm talking about the, uh, I forgot what they're called. Uh, the army calls them the APIs. No, no, not apps. Uh, Talking about like the qualifications for boot camp for basic. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, um, ours was a, a two mile run, uh, 15 minutes as well, I think. Um, 30 push ups, I mean, sit ups, uh, 30 push ups, but no. Yeah, that's army actually. No, uh, pull ups, 30 pull ups, uh, 50 sit ups, two miles and 15 minutes. Yeah. Uh, it was a combat support hospital, uh, cash. It was mixed with Army and Navy. Uh, they were on base, not in unit. 
but we shared the base with them and uh it was all uh, a cash a cash unit Uh, there was two that I was transferred to that, uh, one was here in Missouri, uh, where I'm at now, uh, where I live at now, I should say. I'm not originally from here, though. Um, one was here, the other one was... Remember. But it was uh it was Fort Leonard Wood. And fuck, I cannot do it for for anything. Is it for steel? I wasn't it wasn't for steel. Jackson, I think it was for Jackson. Oh. Dang. I don't know. I, I know that I've been to Camp Victory, Fort Jackson, Fort Seal, Leonard Wood. Uh, have not been to Leavenworth. I was there. Yeah, I was there. I did put uh, the Marines there. I don't know what it was, to be honest. We weren't there for too long. Uh, I want to say it was a couple weeks, two, two to three weeks at best. Uh, I think it was more cleanup, up, like clean up detail. You don't gotta believe me, but It could be, like I said, for all I know, my memory doesn't, it's not good. And I could be mixing some uh, ports with some other ones, or some uh, camps with others. But yeah, overall, it, it, it is what, what it was. I was uh, eight years total service, two years army, six years, sorry, two years marine, six years army. Uh, most of my time with the army was camp uh sorry fort leonard wood that's uh, actually the reason why i ended up moving states because i i like the the environment i used to live in la and uh, i like the environment for how it was over there and stuck with it decided to come back and uh I don't. I don't live anywhere near it though. Still, still a little while away. I don't even remember any of my drill sergeants' names. I know there was a female that. Uh, she was pretty nice to me, I guess. Uh, she was Hispanic. I, I I remember her. I don't remember anybody else. I remember their faces, I don't remember their names. 
Oh good man. Like I said, I don't blame you. My memory's fuzzy. I'd I'd be in the same same situation as you, you know. I've 